mental.
Justin, don't worry about the Beyonce, and I don't want you to focus on that. Oh, 
We're only on page 34. If you're reading anywhere else, today we're literally just on page 34. You don't need to look at any other pages today. Never forget it. What he saw made him not want to live his life 
after all, at all. I want to go down to the NPEs statement because, because basically he said, he said that he would he wouldn't forget the people he saw. He wouldn't forget the things that he saw while he was there. Excellent. Great. Cool. I, 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 um, also, I feel like Wazell is saying that he will never forget how much fear they put into him. Fear. Um, fear. I like to disagree with that. I don't think he's scared. I just think he's like depressed, you know? sad, or like he just put a mental scar on his so, so you wait, hold up. So you wouldn't be scared if somebody just threw your best friend into the fire? Where well, he's not. Well, if I put my best friend I wouldn't be scared of the sad because that's my best friend. I wouldn't be scared. I like to agree with the AV because, sorry, I would like to agree with the AV because um, the way he's speaking and his, the way his tone is, the way the mood of this um, this this passage, this, this oh, yeah. section, cool. yes, it's trying to prove that the way, um, the things that we saw, it was just like, it was like, dang, this is really happening. Now, like, Oh my gosh, I'm just, like, it wasn't really scaring him, it was like, it was like, he made, yes, it was shocking, like, like, it was like, I want to tell you all because I want us to move forward, this is great, because he brought up a valid point, he talked about tone, which is, now we're starting to get to, like, author stuff and what the author does, is there anything, when you were reading that section independently, or even when I was reading it out loud, did you notice anything about, like, how, like, what is Vizel doing in his writing? Like, what is that literary thing that he's doing in his writing that's showing us this impact? Oh. Oh. Turn this off the person next to you for one minute. Oh. Oh. Turn this off the person next to you for one minute. Turn this off the person next to you for one which can bring um, a sad feeling. Yes, I'm 
Yeah. And um, like what uh, I, I was reading, I was reading it. Like what what um he what um he he repeated never shut my up again. I I got like a um, mental image of baby actually being dumped in the fire. Yeah. I want to add on to what the description he gives of the children and like the words he can hear, it makes you like visualize it on your own. Because he doesn't like just say there were children were in the fire. He like makes you sound close to the death of what's going on. Excellent, great. So to that same point, let's focus on this repetition. What we kind of talked about it, Deshaun actually already kind of got at it. I just want to make sure we're all clear. What words does he repeat? I actually want you to write now, underline the words that he repeats. And then to push it a step further, somebody's going to tell me how many times he says the words. Like 20 seconds, just underline the words that he's repeating. 